Okay, here we are. Um, wow, my hair is really bright red on here. Um, I uh, asked you guys for comments last time, and uh, some of you said that you thought this was too bright down here, so I'm, I am going to take some black over it, see what happens. I'm going to use the brayer. Can you see okay? Still pretty bright. I think what I'm going to do is take some purple over it. Maybe that looks better. Thinking about putting something up and through here. I'm not, I'm not really thinking, I'm just knowing what's not working. And I need something going on here. So I'm thinking of coming back in and drawing circles, black circles, into that. Because I can always wipe this off. I'm just playing around now. I have no idea what I'm doing. liking that. I'm going to go back and look at that. And this is called flying by the seat of your pants. Hi guys, uh, here we are again today and I'm about ready to begin and as you can see I have turned this uh, into a uh, vertical as opposed to a horizontal. I like it a lot better and I did add this with some uh, rings and this over here I did uh, push that back a little bit so it's not quite as bright as what it was. So I'm about ready to get started on this again. Not sure what I'm going to do yet, but we will find out. Who knows? I know I do know I want to put more color into it. Not quite enough of color. So other than that, I think we're about ready to get started. I hope I'm not going to be in your way too much. So we will see. I'm going to add a little bit more lightness up into this area and some dark in, into this area and more color down here. That's the plan anyway. Can you see what I'm doing? No, I cannot. time that you make something look darker it looks also it brings the light out in a 
we have to do that with a brush. Try it. Let me try a brush. I drew some circles up in there. I don't know if you can see that or not. Finding circles now. Looks better. You can't really see what's going on because of all of the frickin' glare. But a lot of wonderful color going on down here. I'm going to put some more of that color in. Now I'm going to put some uh, purple and green into it. What this color is, this is actually, um, well you can't see it because of this glare, but it is uh, Quinn Violet with Cobalt Blue in it, so it made it into a more deeper purple. Now I'm going to go for the uh, dark green. I am using Nova colors. I don't know what this color would look like. This is chromium oxide green. This is deep green. Couldn't get that chromium oxide green open. Let's try it again. I think what I'm going to do <coughs> is mix some of the uh, deep green with the chromium oxide green just to get a difference in value. The deep green is really dark where the chromium oxide green is not so much. Kind of a medium green. So I'm going to mix the two see what I come up with. That's 
very interesting. I like that. You can see that or not. I love that right there. I absolutely love what's happening right in here. Wow. How often do you hear me say that? Wow. And I think I want a brighter purple right there. See if I can mix up a, a brighter purple. love that. I'm going to turn it around to see what it looks like. I don't know if you can see that green. You, you can't even see it on the screen.
I'm just barely brushing on the green. Barely. push this back right here. I still like it, I think, better the other way around. It's going to go the other way. I don't I prefer it the other way around. But I do, I still have to push this back right here a little bit too bright right there. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Now I'm putting just, I just put a little bit of black on that. Now I think I want some more raw sienna up here coming across, I think. Never know for sure. We never know for sure. Nope, don't like that. I like it here. Don't like it there. Or do I? Let me go back and look at it from a distance. No, I don't. Then I say to myself, do I want a thin, a real thin line of sienna coming across the top? I'm going to let this dry and I'm going to try it. If I don't like it, I'll take it off. Okay, I have it taped. stand back and take a look at this from a distance see what I think of it it's good it just needs to be uh, it just needs to look older that's all like it does down below so I'm gonna let that dry and then take some colors over it maybe some lines through it it up. Put it down and mess it up. And I'm just kind of dry br brushing black over. Yeah, I took some 
screen and to it right over there. And that looks better. I'm going to try spraying it with water, seeing what I get. Don't have a clue what I'm going to get, but let's try it. Well, I like those strips coming through. I don't know what it's going to look like after it's dry. I'm getting some nice strips coming down through. Now I have to decide on some of them. Some of them I'll keep and some of them I'll wipe away. I think it's done, guys. I'll take another look at it tomorrow. See what we have. But one thing for sure, I don't want all of these to uh, stop at the same place. So, I'm going to have to stop some of them earlier. Like this one's going to stop. I'm going to try something. I'm going to try dripping a little bit of purple. See what happens. I may like it, I may not. Over here. Probably wipe that off. But I do like what's happening. Yipper. Some of them I'm just let barely stain on there, just so you see a hint of it. And I am going to call it finished. I know you can't see anything about what's going on, but I'm, I thank you for persevering with me on this. Um, 
what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a uh, close-up and a photo. That'll be better. So, thanks a lot. And please subscribe okay. if you haven't. Here's the painting. You can see all the color in it. A lot of color in it. Still a lot of glare right there. I don't think I'm gonna get rid of that glare. You can see a lot of color there as well. When we come down, see the drips just slightly that's what I wanted a little bit of purple and green I'm very pleased with it very very pleased with it so I thank you very much for watching guys and like I said if you haven't subscribed I sure would appreciate it have a great day